Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So I try to do this high ponytail thing going on today. I wrap my hair in a ponytail and then I put my clip in extensions and kind of wrapped it around there. I got to do a little work on that. So I just wanted to kind of address that. I'm like, What is going on with her hair? So yeah, so that's what's up with the ponytail. Um, so today we, I, we <laughs> are going to be going over the LA Colors True Matte Long Wearing High Pigment Foundation. And God, I really like this foundation. I really love it. It feels so good on my skin. It feels so light. And I actually put almost two layers of it on because I put a little extra over here on the sides because I wanted a little bit more coverage. And it feels like I have no makeup on. So that already off the bat is like phenomenal for me because I hate foundations that feel sticky, icky, and thick and heavy. So that's great. And it's long wearing, which is perfect. Let me give you guys a little information about the foundation. Let me just look it up here on my phone because, of course, I'm unprepared. I should already have it out, and I don't. Um, LA Colors Truly Matte Foundation. And this has been out for a while. I just have so many, not so many products, but I have some products that I bought a long time ago, and I wanted to do reviews on them, and I just got busy, never did the review. So I said, let me do it, because I love doing the reviews not only for you guys, but for myself as well, because I don't really know, um, you know, you buy a foundation, but most people don't, well, I don't anyway, I just kind of pick it up if I think I see someone else using it and it looks good or whatever the reason. I don't really know, like, oh, is this a long wearing? Is this a full coverage? I just see it on someone else. I'm like, it looks good. I got to get it, that kind of thing. So when I do the reviews, I get to see what the foundation's really about, so... Okay, so it comes in, it looks like, I'm on the LA Colors website, it looks like it comes in 14 different shades, um, so that's number one, it comes in in 14 different shades, pretty good variety, you guys can kind of see there, those are the different shades, um, it actually doesn't seem like they have too many dark, really dark colors, which, mm, maybe they do, maybe they do, maybe it's just the way I'm looking at it, okay, so 14 shades, to complement a wide range of skin tones. Okay, that's what it says. And then let's get into the details. I mean, it doesn't say much on the LA Colors website. It's very, I think it says more on the product than on the website. It says it's long wearing, high pigment foundation, which is just what it says here. It, it blends to a beautiful matte powder-like finish. Um, okay, yeah, and available in the 14 shades. So let's just go ahead and get into the video and you guys can see me applying the foundation to my skin and then you guys can get an idea of what you think about it. So I'm gonna go ahead and start applying the foundation. So the foundation has a nice feel to it. It feels, um, really cool could just be the temperature in my house I'm not sure <laughs> it doesn't feel like sticky or tacky or nothing like that it has just a nice lightweight feel to it which I like I hate those foundations that just have this like sticky feel to them where you just feel like you have something on your face this feels like you have nothing on so I like that already Looks like it's blending out nicely. It kind of looks like it's already oxidizing because I'm a little darker down here and I was kind of worried about the foundation being a little too light, but it looks like it's blending in nicely. It's got good coverage. I almost want to put a little bit more on, but I have to put my concealer still, still so I don't want to put too much. I'm going to try just a little bit more. Just like over in this area where I have a lot of like spotting and see if it gives me a little bit more coverage. Okay, so let's see if doing this gives me a little bit more coverage. It does. Okay, so, all right. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the rest of my makeup on. I'll be right back with you guys. 
Okay, so you guys got to see me try out the foundation. Um, like I said, you know, in my intro and like I said in the middle of the video, love number one compliment about this foundation is I love the feel. So lightweight, so pretty. I didn't put, no, I did put powder. I was going to say I didn't put powder. I did put a little bit of powder on. But um, it says that it's like a powder-like finish. And it does. I put a little bit of powder on because I just, I don't know. I felt like I needed a little bit. So, but uh, yeah, beautiful finish. Looks really good. Good coverage. Long wearing, I'm not sure. I got to wear it out through the day and see and let you guys know. Um, I'll let you, I don't do, most of my videos, I don't do it where I wear and then come back just because I kind of have a crazy hectic life. So, but I'll let you guys know, you know, in my other videos, you'll know because if I keep using a foundation over and over again, you know, I like the foundation. <laughs> So, um, but yeah, so far so good. And I like, the other thing that was good about this foundation is I'm a little bit darker down here. Like I told you guys, I went to the beach not too long ago. So I wasn't sure when I first put the foundation on my skin, I thought it looked a little bit wider than my neck and my chest area, but it blended out really nicely. Like even as I was blending it, I felt like it was oxidizing and you know, the color was matching my skin tone. So I like that about it as well. But yeah, this is pretty much it. Um, and so we'll see. I'll let you guys know in my next video how it comes out. But thank you guys so much for stopping by. And remember, if you are new, well, not even if you're new to my channel, if you like this video, go ahead and click that like button below. It helps me out a lot. And also, if you are new to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button so you can always get notified of when I post a new video. And yeah. So that's pretty much it, and I will see you guys next time. Hopefully next time I do the high ponytail, I'll get it a little bit better, but I'm working on it. I need to try some new hairstyles because I feel like I always use the same hairstyles in my videos, and I need some variety in my life. I think you guys need to look at some change and some variety as well. Um, <laughs> but anyways, so yeah. So thank you guys so much for stopping by. I will see everyone in my next video. Bye, guys.